Hi, Aaron here from Superior Singing Method. This is Try This Try This Singing High Notes Hack. It's kind of a weird name for a video, but it's a it's a high note hack, which such things exist. Like singing isn't just about if you do this, then you'll get this. There are certain hacks that we can trick ourselves and trick our brains and trick our muscles and our bodies in order to perform faster. And I'm gonna give you an example of how and why that happens. So I'll give you the exercise first, but I, I want to explain how and why it's working because I think that's going to help you, right? So um, it's going to be a staccato. Staccato just means like short, quick bursts. And actually, I'm going to do a little explaining and then I'll come back to the exercise because I'd, I'd, I'd like to understand this. So uh, there's something called plyometric exercises that they do in sports to help people be able to hit further, throw further, run faster, you know, further faster. It's this idea of creating a muscle memory that your muscle can repeat. And it happens with these short, punchy movements. So a lot of the jumping and the running and all that stuff, it's these short, quick, fast bursts that helps their muscles like clinch up really quick and do these different things. You know, there's all these studies of how it works. Well, I was thinking um, years ago now, but that the voice is basically made up of a bunch of micro muscles and the same thing could work and has proven to work to help you sing higher notes. So this plyomet this idea of these plyometric exercises using these short, quick bursts, that's when I said staccato. Staccato is like the short, quick burst exercises. What happens when you do these short, quick bursts is you're able to sing higher notes than you normally would when you're doing them fast and short and quick. And then what happens when you do that is as you're singing those higher notes and those quicker bursts, you create muscle memory up there in your higher register. And so when you go to sing, your muscle remembers and you're able to sing those higher notes. That make sense? So here we go. And then I have another little hack for you after we get done with this one. So this one, it's going to be like a da 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 one, two, three, four, five, four, three, two, one type of flow. But it's going to be with short burst on ha. Ha. So it's going to be like this. Um, ha, 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 ha. And then I want you to climb up. Ha, 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 However high you can go, um, do that. But I, I do it two or three times. And as always, when you're doing high note things and you're going higher in your range, always remember, you want to challenge your voice, but you don't want to push and force your voice to where you're going to create strain. Nobody wants that. Now, there's I got one more for you, this little hack. This is one that actually opera singers, um, classical singers for years, and even pop singers have, have used. And this is one when you're going to sing a higher note, because as you may have heard me say it before, there's a psychological aspect to singing high notes. And, and if we're leading up to a high note in a song, we're like, ah, and we tend to tense up and do all these weird things to not be able to sing the high note. So what you can do is right when you're going to sing, you're going da 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 da, singing a song, singing a song. When you're going to hit that high note where you know it is, I want you to just bend your knees at the waist right at that moment or um, bend your knees at the waist, bend your knees at that moment and sink down or bend at the waist right when you're doing that note. It throws your psycho your body off, which throws your psychology off a little bit. I know it sounds completely weird and too good to be true, but just try it. Like, what can I hurt, right? Just try it. Because um, it does work. It's, it's, it's been, used, been used for years. So um, try those two things, the short bursts with the staccatos. Oh, click the link below. I've got my number one singing killer quiz. I can, if you haven't had a chance to take that, it just takes like 30 seconds and I send you some free videos to help you fix your number one singing killer. It should be helpful for you. I'm doing a, a bunch of videos right now, doing like a, I'm batching a bunch of videos. So hit the notification bell to be notified. Uh, when when new one comes out, like the video, comment, love hearing from you. That's all I got. So click the link below and I'll see you next video.